everyone it's Tanya and I am back today to create this ghost card with you I am so excited about the new Tom Holtz Stampers and Anonymous release and I just had to pull out some of my older stamps and create a card today here I'm showing you some of the products that we'll use today but as always the rest will be linked below Okay, the first thing we're going to do is start with our card background and you'll see here I'm just figuring out where I want to put everything and getting my moon mass ready. This is the smallest of the moons from the moon mass set and I just use a little mint tape to hold that down. Here I am laying out all of my Distress Oxides to ink up this background. For this background, you'll see that I start with the lightest color and move to the darkest color. So I started out with Fossilized Amber, I go to Spice Marmalade, Sealess Preserves, Faded Jeans, and then go around the entire outside of it with Black Soot. You will see me go back in with a couple of the colors and just go back over them, blending them out. And as it gets towards the end, you're probably going to be thinking, this is a hot mess, but I promise you it's going to turn out great. <laughs> At first when I was doing it, I was like, this is not going to look good, and then... I really like the end result of this. Here you're going to see me pull out a little cup. I'm going to sprinkle some mica powder in that and mix it with water. And then I'm just going to take, take two paint brushes and kind of tap this onto my card to give it a nice little starry night effect. Now I'm going to remove the moon mask. And I'm going to dry the card and then I'm going to put the top layer of the moon mask down and I'm just going to use what's left on the brush from the fossilized amber and kind of lightly add that to the top of the moon mask to add the little craters and things to the moon. Now I'm going to do my stamping. I'm going to stamp my ghost onto some Tim Holtz worn wallpaper. This is from his Halloween collection. Um, I think from 2020. And then I'm going to stamp my house onto a piece of um, paper from his departed paper pad. I have to give a huge shout out to Amy over at Perry Paper and Ink. That's where I got this idea for the ghost. She made the cutest little ghosties on to printed um, cardstock and then used her alcohol inks to color them. I thought I would do the same with this on the worn wallpaper. Mine's going to have a little more of a vintagey, grungy vibe to it. And, 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 you know, true Tim Holtz style, that grungy vibe. So... Again, huge shout out to Amy over Perry Paper and Ink. If you have not seen her video on her little cute ghosty card, you have to go watch that. Thank you. 
Now I'm just going to go in with my Ohuhu alcohol markers and add some shading. I use YG4, YG040 and YG080 on both the ghost and the house. Um, I didn't do I didn't color the entire um, ghost nor the house. I'm just adding some shading where I think it needs to be. As you can see, these were magically fussy cut out. And now we'll get to building our card. You will see here me moving them around quite a bit, trying to figure out where I want to put everything on the card. And I end up deciding pretty much on the last one that I did with the house kind of off the card a little bit and the ghost kind of tilted. Right here, my glue bottle clogged up for some reason and I had to unclog it. Here I'm just going to add the card front we made to the card base. Now I'm going to stamp out my sentiment onto some cardstock and then you'll see that I trim that up and add just a little bit of black ink to the edge and use some foam tape to pop it up onto the card.
an air card is complete. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. It helps to get this channel viewed more. As always, all of the links for everything that I can link will be in the description box below. If you have any questions, please comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as I possibly can. Thanks for watching and have a great day.